Hey guys, I know I'm a little bit over here, but hi, welcome to another video. Um, today, we're, as the title implies, we're gonna um, we're updating you guys on how Amber's doing with her foot. Um, it doesn't look too swelled up. So yeah, that's pretty much all that's left of it. It's gone from like a balloon, a golf ball to a, um, it, a, a ping pong ball. It, a golf, a golf. Well, <laughs> you just said. A golf ball to a ping pong ball, the, about the same <laughs> size. I'm trying to I figure would, out a good size. Let me give you a proper analogy. Thank you. So it's gone from a basketball to a deflated balloon. Mm -hmm. That's probably a better way to look at it. When it was first, um, right before the surgery, which I know we put up a video about it, that one. But prior to that, it uh, was swelled up like a gigantic. It, it it was it was basically like the word sh like a tennis ball shoved in her foot. <laughs> I know we're we're using a lot of sports balls analogy, but it, I'm whatever. I'm a sports, so that works. Um, I'm just good with analogies, so that's why my He's end works nuts, with it. And I married him, so it all makes kind of on me. Hmm. So I have a nut joke for you. Uh, either way around, though, yeah. So. Quick short little update. Uh, she wanted me to up you, update you guys on like how this is going. So yeah, my we, incisions are pretty much healed, and I'm able to stand on my foot a little bit. And he tried tickling my foot earlier, and when I moved it, it didn't hurt. So. And I mean, prior to that, it was feeling, hurting. Feeling was kind of not. Yeah, it was. It was just non-existent, pain. pretty much. It was pain. It wasn't feeling. It was pain. Yeah. Even though. Anyway, the only thing that the doctors are requesting of her right now is just whenever she's going anywhere to, like, order food. They they, so, they have requested her to do it in bed at times while it's needed. Those but were it their... doesn't look like it's needed right now because the yeah. ice has helped the swelling go down a lot. So. Because the direct wording at the time was, if needed. If it gets to a point where it's healed up enough, she doesn't have to do it anymore. And, I mean, I've seen close-up on the incision. It's pretty much just... All that's left is for, like, it to entirely seal in the blood that's dried on top to just go away. I mean, there is a, there is slight pain when he does, like, touch the side that the surgery was, like, the main incision is on. But other than that... Not much left. <laughs> yeah, it's not much pain left. And when I did that, I was doing what a doctor would... You know, you guys... For anybody he who's had a He was squeezing the bottom of my foot. For basically anybody who's been to a generic doctor's appointment, they'll always, like, check down certain parts of your body to see if there's any sensitivities. Um, this is right before they start using like those tiny hammer things, and I actually forget the, the name The reflex of... hammer? I thought it was a fancier name than that. Not really. Sure. The reflex hammers, they'll like, when they, but right before they use those, they'll like feel around to see if any sensitivity is there. That's basically what I was doing with her, but just trying to be very gentle that way if there was any I think he's nuts, but he's very sweet and a very caring person. Hmm. But either way, yeah, there's an update on this. Um, quick little video, uh, but we're going to head off. Thanks for tuning in, guys, and we'll see you guys later. Bye! Bye-bye.